All right, first thing you want to do when you come to one of these is you want to make sure you have wooden cloth on you because it will be pretty damaged and then you want to repair them, just like so. Put your fuel up top, press the burn button. So basically how the hot air balloon works is as you go up, you'll hit different wind streams that go in different directions. So basically how you steer is you get into a wind stream that you want to get into or the direction you want to go and you just stay in that wind stream. Uh, but you want to get out to first so you'll just hit the burn button. As you'll see the balloon will start to turn in a circle clockwise. Once you get your desired altitude then you'll unhit the burn button. So we're going to go try to land on oil. So as you see these flags, they'll tell you the direction you're going, where the one stream you're in. So we're getting to the point where the flag is going to start pointing at oil. So once you want to get to the flag to point at oil, so we have to burn a little bit more, and that flag's starting to move to oil. So we're kind of in that direction. So once you see that flag stop to move, you want to hit the burn button for about five seconds, and then let go. Um, usually it's like five seconds on, five seconds off. It'll kind of keep you in a straight line. Um, but as you're going, you basically just want to just watch the flags, make sure the flag is going in the direction you want to go to. Just like that. So we'll cut it off. The flag's starting to move. Once we see the flag just stop moving, we'll hit the burn button for like three or four seconds. Just because we were a little off target, so I needed to do it a little bit less time. Just like so. So landing is kind of a little tricky. You kind of have to have timing a little bit and you're kind of going to have to like mess with the burn button as you land. Um, so you kind of want to like aim for the middle, kind of like overshoot it because you're going to start like descending counterclockwise. So you kind of want to go past it clockwise and then land on it. Uh, so like right here, if we get it just to go a little bit further right here, we'd probably be good right here. So it's going to start descending going counterclockwise. We might have to hit the burn button, um, but as we're descending, I think we're going to be good. Laying right on top. Just like so. So as I'm going to show you right now is how durable these are. We're going to run into some SAMs and see how it does. Um, Sonic Barons are pretty durable. So we're going over it. So you're going over base. took a full strike and it did about 450 damage so it probably gave me about three strikes I will show you how many HVs this takes now too just flying these on intoxicated servers or any other like creative type server where you can spawn them in as an admin uh spawn in your low grade and then you can just practice flying around practicing your landing so you're not gonna start buying hot air balloons at bandit camp or outpost if bandit camp is mode with outpost this is 150 scrap you also can find hot air balloons throughout the whole map they come with storage As well as they have the new edition of the armor combat. For 220 scrap, you can get a hot air balloon and a armor module. You want to put the armor module in, just hold E on the burn, and then it'll bring up a menu and you equip armor. Just have to have it in your inventory.